Good day, YouTube. Today I'm just taking a bit of a quick look at Ubuntu Budgie Edition, so also version 22.04, which is actually the beta release. So it is actually uh, set to come out on the, I believe it's the 19th of April, so the next two to three weeks or so there. But basically all sorted out and ready to go, so I thought I'd give you guys a bit of a look at it. Now the major difference here for this operating system, as you might guess, is the Budgie desktop environment. So it is really uh, a little bit different to the rest, it's built from the, the ground up in a way uh, although I've got to say it is tightly integrated with the gnome stack but it is an well, really a desktop environment unto itself there quite a popular one there it seems there as well so basically you've got your start menu you've got your search heads up display you've got all your options like that there you've got your own little dock there as well which is nice to see uh, this can of course be customized but let's have a look at uh, maybe some of the, there's a little spot here to, to check the types of apps that are available. So you've got your games, graphics, internet, office apps, and a few extra ones here and there. But it, uh, it's very reminiscent of the Mate desktop environment, in my opinion, with a, uh, yeah, I guess, a just a, a, a dash down the bottom there, or a taskbar of sorts, or a launcher. Uh, if we were to also maybe have a look at the uh, file manager, now this one here is the, the GNOME files, or at least it should be. I am just learning to navigate as I'm chatting with you guys now. So here it is, great, I found the help menu. There we go, so it's the Nemo, uh, well, aka Nautilus, aka GNOME files, but the Nemo file manager there. Nice little dark mode there as well, I've gotta say. Right click and open terminal, and uh, that keeps me pretty happy. Speaking of the terminal, let's jump into the, uh, the, the back end here and see what it's working with. So it's working with the 5.15 kernel, so that's really nice to see under the hood. Uh, it helps with more later and greater hardware, be it CPUs, GPUs, and the like. We can see the desktop environment information here, so version 10.6 for the DE there but uh, not to be confused with Ubuntu 22.04, which is uh, the version that it's based off. Now let's see what else we have of any interest here for us. And we've got the, uh, let's see, probably last but not least, I'll just quickly jump into this and see what it looks like with RAM on boot up. So it does actually use quite a bit of RAM there. Uh, in fact, there's a bit of in the swap drive there as well. So you're almost looking at about a gigabyte of RAM on boot up. So it's certainly not the, the most lightweight of operating systems. Um, so always something to keep in mind if you're going to use it for say a, a notebook, a netbook, uh, you know, uh, an old desktop PC. Yeah, so it's not exactly the lightest weight operating system to say the least. I would probably recommend XFCE, Lubuntu or Mate editions instead. But that's pretty much it guys, I just wanted to give you a bit of a look and feel uh, for Ubuntu uh, Budgie Edition version 22.04, like I say currently in beta release but it is uh, certainly set to come out uh, shortly officially. So thanks for your time, please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button and I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one.